The following is a selected video from masterthecontent.com where you will find an extensive video library of lectures for a variety of standardized admission tests. We offer over 600 hours of detailed video lectures for a multitude of standardized tests. Use our interactive in-lecture table of contents to find specific topics of interest. Work through numerous in-lecture examples to help you internalize concepts. To learn more, visit masterthecontent.com. Your career, our passion. When the object lays outside the center of curvature. If we take a look here now at figure 22, even though we only needed two rays, we see ray tracing being done for rays 1, 2, and 3. In this scenario, the object lays outside the center of curvature. Note the distance of the object from the vertex is greater than the distance of the radius, that being from the center of curvature to the vertex. And the image is located between the center of curvature and the focal point. Now, let me ask you, is the image real or virtual? Well, the image here, it's going to be real since the image is formed by actual right light rays in front of the mirror, right? And with concave mirrors, real images are seen whenever the object lies beyond the focal point. Next, let me ask, is the image going to be erect or inverted? As we see here, the image is inverted. And lastly, we can see that the image will be reduced, that is, the image is smaller than the object. Let's go ahead now and take a look at scenario two. Now, here we'll begin with figure 23. Looking at figure 23, we see that 